My Longings, a poetic memoir by Amy J. Levine. I long to hear the voice of the Good Shepherd. I long to sit and bask in his inviting presence. I long to listen to his life that dwells in me. I long to wait upon the Lord in expectancy. I long to forgive those who laugh at me. I long to stop the clutter that fills my mind. I long to react with wisdom when I am misunderstood. I long to prance in open fields with my beloved Savior. I long to trust the Lord in every circumstance. I long to heed my neighbor without interrupting. I long to make my neighbor more important than myself. I long to express my thoughts at the right moment. I long to be silent when words are not necessary. I long to behold my love with eyes that speak tenderly. I long to discover the sweet melodies of the songbird. I long to evince the fragrance of Messiah whence I go. I long to give thanks in all things. I long not to belittle others who are different. I long to seek first the kingdom of God and his righteousness. I long to see a halt to unjust killings. I long to see men free, locked up unjustly. I long to smile at the lonely ones sitting. I long to capture the beauty of my clouds. I long to observe dolphins skipping on ocean waters. I long to still my soul and hear the rumble of thunder and soft rain. I long to smell the rain after a thunderstorm. I long to sip my tea and eat delicacies with Mozart. I long to bear the injury of another. I long to express the language of a poet. I long to inhale the aroma of roses. I long to move on tiptoes gracefully. I long to see the wingspan of an eagle in motion. I long to comfort an aged woman all alone. I long to watch the ocean waves fold neatly into place. I long to feel my feet on cool, soft sand along the ocean's edge. I long to survey a child jumping in puddles. I long to sit and read amidst the swaying trees. I long to ride upon a horse and glide across the meadow. I long to see the color of skin not hinder others. I long to tell the world of his great love before time began. I long to laugh with friends to no fatigue. I long to weep when sadness calls my name. I long to love my sons who came forth from me. I long to consider the whisper of the wind in my ear. I long to be still before my maker. I long to hold a little lamb nestled in my arms. I long to create a picture in words and a song. I long to converse with you in different seasons. I long to thank the Lord for speaking the universe into existence. I long to wake before the sunrise in adoration. I long to uphold the rejected one and give acceptance again. I long to stroll along the shore collecting shells. I long to share a meal in joy and harmony. I long for man to walk in liberty. I long to find the words of hate removed one day. I long for man to see the cross of Calvary. I long to witness the prophets of old pierce the heart of man. I long to release the dove in our land. I long to stand in the shoes of another. I long to revisit the old oak tree in childhood community. I long for those to forgive my absence in tragedy. I long to celebrate the birth of a newborn babe with radiance. 
I long to watch the elderly clasp hands in sunset. I long to esteem the hard worker of humility. I long to give homage to greatness in musical soundness. I long to reach a mountain peak and touch the snow beneath. I long to gather snow so white and feel its chill inside of me. I long to be allured by the Almighty who speaks to me so kindly. I long to be given vineyards in the wilderness from thence. I long to open the door of hope in the Valley of Achor with singing. I long to be hidden in the rock of my salvation with water springs. I long in the darkest night to welcome peace within. I long to be immersed in artistic beauty from afar. I long to muse euphony and, and take it all in. I long to embrace the silence that overshadows me. I long to have compassion on humanity. I long to believe without seeing with mine eyes. I long to soar the open skies with purpose and a vision. I long to rest against a tree of golden apples yellow. I long to ponder planets above in mystery sublime. I long to dine with wine and cheese and celebrate life in the country. I long to look inside the eyes of a docile canine. I long to examine the diligence of ants working together. I long to peer at busy bees extracting pollen in a breeze. I long to gaze a butterfly fluttering, drawing nectar up, up, up. I long to hear the symphony of crickets come to a crescendo. I long to burn with passion that's driven from above. I long for the living God to fill my thirsty soul. I long to travel to spiral galaxies and dance with the stars around and around. I long to share a covered bench and dangle legs with locomotion. I long to know who really is on first or is it on second. I long to be entwined in the art of penning rhymes. I long to stroll the tunnel of trees, majestic and strong, a wonder to me. I long to see amazing clouds darken and become one. I long to see across the sky the splendor of colors reach each side. I long to sow the seeds of forgiveness and put away anger that tends to linger. I long to rest my eyes on each day and capture the essence as I pray. I long to speak with a friend of jovial consequence. I long to accept the thorns of life attached to blooming roses. I long for the lines of communication to yield to human expression. I long to be covered with his pinions and find refuge under his wings. I long for rolling hills upon my crown to melt the ridges I long to convey for you to come with me and look around and see the brilliance of our town. I long to contemplate my youth and memory and come to age so very blissfully. I long for man to surrender selfish aim and give alone the preeminence of his reign. I long to stand with living stones who make Christ Jesus their eternal home. My Longings by Amy J. Levine